Well, that's a little bit of potting in the last frame, break of 48 and 40 in the previous frame. It's uh, certainly given him a little bit of confidence. He seems to have a bit more flow. He's a little bit of trouble with his tip, I think. I don't know if he feels it's getting loose. No problem with the pink going out of commission at the moment because the black's still on. I think he can run through for the black actually off one cushion. I was just going to say he could play for the blue if he didn't want to. 16. Risk running through on and off the cushion, but. A chance of getting a few points here. As it's the last frame, I'd be surprised if it's a frame winning con contribution. You never know. players seem to have found this evening it's very hard to maneuver the cue ball when you're trying to force it sure sign that the table is a bit a little bit lifeless that was the best cannon 31. he's on a red to the left middle he's one on one to the right corner but just a little bit of work to do with the cue ball Nothing seems to have been plain sailing for either player this evening. Everything they've got they've had to work hard for. But Sean Murphy must be sat in his chair now. Very concerned. And that's the reason for it. He's still only at 78% pop success. Jamie Cope going up to 87%. He's getting near that 90% I feel you need. It's just on about, about on a red here. I don't know which way you play it. It's split them nicely. One good pot and one good positional shot. This could be end of match. Does it go to the far left corner? If it does, can he just punch it in and stay on the pink? Or will he have to play in the left middle? It's the far left corner. This could be the match winner. That far, it was quite amazing. So Sean Murphy has been handed another lifeline. I mean, it was so far away. I mean, obviously, clearly past that red he made contact with. Oh, and Sean can't do anything about it. How disappointing. Dream about getting this many chances to win a match, don't you, Willie? 
You just dream about it. Yeah, both players have had so many chances of each frame. Neither of them can complain. A little bit of a bounce off the cushion there, but it's just amazing how many chances to be gifted. Yeah, we talk about the modern day, and if you get one or possibly two chances of frame, you, you've got to settle for that. But chances for both players are just coming thick and fast. You make a mistake, and before you know it, you're right back at the table. So this blue will put in 54 points in front. Still be a possible. 83 left on the table, so looking for three more reds after this blue. And not quite the right angle on the blue. It's 54 in front with a possible 83 on. This is probably almost game ball because you can see him getting the desired reds if this goes in. Look at his, once again, he's missed it. Jimmy Cockney. Virtually game ball, that was. Well, in all honesty, that was almost inevitable. And catching the red that thick, and just going to kiss the other red and to catch that very thin. And surely that will be his last shot this evening. I'll be amazed if Jamie Cole can't clinch the frame and match at this visit now. Although he's not perfect on this blue. able to hold the blue spot to retain position on the red and the pink spots available. Same. Of course he now pots this red, comes down for the black. Seven. Pot the black to go 68 points in front with 67 remaining. see it but that's how it's going to stay because it doesn't look as though he's developed a red there but Sean Murphy is just going to need the one snooker on a night at the moment you want to forget so but for that snooker Jamie Culp is into the second round of the Masters, another surprise result. And the handshake was offered soon after. It was Jamie Cope's most significant uh, win since he made the semis of the Shanghai Masters earlier in the season. It's the second time in a week, in fact, that he's had the better of Sean Murphy after winning the championship. Win. Sean said afterwards that he'd been distracted by a movement from the audience during that match, so rather unhappy evening for him.